I'm Bob Buckley. Crews are demolishing Peeler Elementary School after years of the school sitting vacant. Fox 8's Lauren Crawford is live right outside the gates where the demolition is happening. So, Lauren, how long has the work been underway? Yeah, well, crews have been out here for about three hours this morning. As you can see and probably hear behind me, they are knocking down Peeler Elementary School. Now, they've been making progress out here this morning in what I imagine to be an all day process. Now, on the flip side of things, it's been a bittersweet morning for several neighbors and those who live in the area who have been coming out, watching the process, taking pictures on their smartphones, and sharing memories. Now, the demolition of the school is being uh, made room for the new Hampton Peeler Elementary School. It is one of 13 schools in the Guilford County School District's master facilities plan to be remodeled and reopened. Now, this is a process that started years ago in 2018 when a tornado came through this area and damaged Peeler. School officials say the building was no longer safe after that and students were sent to other schools. Demolition was supposed to happen next year in 2022, but district leaders decided to speed up the timeline after the abandoned school was set on fire last month, causing even more damage. Now, investigators confirmed the fire was an act of arson, and they are still looking for whoever started that fire. The school will now be rebuilt and reopened as Hampton Peeler, which combines the former Hampton Elementary and Pe Peeler Open Elementary, both which were damaged by a tornado in 2018. Now, while some have been waiting for this project to get moving, others out here this morning are sad to see it go. I just had the best fun I had in that school. I missed the teachers, the principals, everything in that school. I've been here all my life. And that school been here all my life. And I miss it. And everybody gonna cry right here. And the new Hampton Peeler Elementary School is expected to cost the Guilford County School District about $33.5 million. This will be serving as a new performing arts school for about 700 students, uh, grades K through 5. And again, today's demolition is part of the two, uh, $300 million bond referendum that voters approved back in 2020. Live in Greensboro, Lauren Crawford, Fox 8 News.